Hello Youtubers, I'm Parways and this is our 24th video in Learn Django 2.1. In the previous video we have learned how you can create flash messages in Django. So this is from the previous video. If I add a username, for example, new app, I want to add new username and new add a password, new password and add an email address, new at gmail.com and a phone number and if I click on submit you can see I have a nice flash message that you have registered successfully and if I check my admin panel I have this new username and if I check my database MySQL database and I have this new uh, username also in here so in this video uh, we are going to uh, talk about creating a form using model form, model form so in the previous videos we have created nice forms using form class but in this video I want to show you how you can create model forms and uh, basically when I'm going to uh, develop a web application in Django uh, I mostly use a uh, model form so now <coughs> open your uh, PyCharm ID I want to create a new uh, a view for this so I call it diff model form view and uh, request like this and I'm going to copy uh, from here uh, I want to copy this and paste it in my model form view like this and I want to change the render to model form.html now and I want to create this uh, HTML so open your templates and in here uh, I want to copy this about page and paste it in here so model form dot html okay now change the title to this as our uh, model form page model form page okay also open uh, your urls dot by we want to add a new url in here so let me just copy this copy the path Mm. copy uh, and paste it in here and I want to change this to uh, leave it uh, like this and in here mm. change this to model form and views dot dot uh, dot model form model form view and the name is uh, at model form okay and now if I uh, refresh my page and my server is let me check my server is restarted yeah now it's restarted and now I want to go to the model form yeah this is our model form page now we are going to create our model form in here so open your forms.py and uh, you can make at the top or at the bottom there is no problem but in here I want to class at name of uh, registration registration model form this time we want this should be forms dot model form model form okay in the previous video it was forms.form 
but in this video it's forms dot model form now we are going to create a class meta in here it is a built-in class and model forms now we are going to create our uh, model in here a model object in here so first let me import uh, from dot models uh, what was my model name let me just uh, check it I think it was registration data yeah so yeah re registration data uh, import registration data from Oh, import is wrong. Import registration data. Okay. Uh, we are going to create our model object in here because of why? Because we need to tell Django that based on this model, we are going to create our forms. So based on uh, based on my registration uh, data, registration model data, I want to create my form. So registration data okay now we create our fields and I have uh, four fields I have a username I have a password I have email And also at the end I have phone okay based on my uh, my model and these fields I want to create my form after this after creating this now uh, I'm going to uh, open my uh, model form dot HTML okay before our uh, opening HTML file, we need to open our views.py because we need to create our context variable. And at the top, we need to import a uh, model form. Registration model form. And now, uh, in our model form view, we need to uh, create a uh, our context variable and I call it uh, model form registration model form okay uh, now I'm going to open my HTML file and let me just check it form uh, not form model form dot <coughs> model form now let me uh, refresh my page yeah you can see now we have form but this time it's not based on form class it is based on model form and also let me just make it uh, as a paragraph dot as p yeah you can see uh, now uh, we want to insert data we want to insert data from our model form to the mysql database uh, this will be a little bit different than the form class now you can see uh, what i mean so uh, let me just in here uh, create a form action so form action right now uh, I don't give uh, any action for this and the method is post let me close my form tag and also I need to add a submit button in here input type submit and the value is submit
Okay. And uh, now let me refresh it. Also, we need to add C CSRF underscore token because we will get an error. C uh, yeah C S R F underscore token okay and now uh, let me open my views.py now I'm going to create my uh, add f uh, view function so now in here uh, I want to create a new uh, method and I call it diff add model form and request now I'm going to create the object of my registration model form so I call it my model form and uh, it should be like this my model form and registration model form registration model form and uh, it is request dot post like we have given in the form we need to give also in here request dot post and if you check uh, your let me check the if you see in here we have a form registration form and request dot post uh, after this uh, now we are going to check our form uh, that if our form is valid uh, if my model form dot is valid okay if it is valid and uh, now you can see the difference between model form and Django form uh, in here we have uh, created a bunch of uh, for example we have uh, get our username from our uh, text inputs and we have uh, used clean data for cleaning our data but uh, in here uh, you can simply uh, say that my model form dot save just like this and at the end we need to uh, redirect our page so mm, let me just copy this return redirect and paste it in here and I want to redirect this to the my uh, add model form at model for where is it view okay now we need to our uh, add our this add model form uh, to our URLs open your URLs.py and let me add it in here uh, just I'm going to copy this, paste it in here. Uh, the name is add model form in here. Views dot add model form, and this is add model form. And uh, let me change this name to the or change this to. Okay, I want to change this to just and I want this should be insert data insert data okay now just copy this and open your model form dot html and the form action we need to add this URL 
and their data. Let me refresh my page and hopefully uh, we don't get any error and uh, not reverse match and their data not found is not valid view function. Uh, let me just check this that uh, where is my problem? What's the problem? Okay, there was no error because uh, I have not restarted my server and I get the error. So now it's working and uh, now I want to add a, a username in here, for example, a model username and a password, for example, I want to give it like uh, FGHN and the email address. So I want to give it uh, a phone number and if I click on submit, you can see that uh, our data is uh, submitted. And if I uh, check first, let me check my database. Now you can see I have a username, it's model username. And uh, if I check also my admin panel and refresh this, you can see I have a model username. So let me add another one, for example, hello username and a password uh, and then email and the phone submit yeah if I check my admin I have this and if I check my database my skill database I have this username uh, thank you guys. In the next video, I will show you that how you can use widgets in model form. If you have any question, please let me know. And for the further videos, don't forget subscription of my channel.